Hello everyone, welcome back to Case of Cud, Gunslinger. Let's continue on. We're heading towards the Rush Wells, we're almost there. In fact, I should start, I wouldn't be surprised if uh, some copper wire doesn't start showing up, because <clears throat> it's usually just kind of hanging out, near and around and underneath. Uh oh, looks like we might be having bacon for breakfast here, unless he catches me on fire. <laughs> nope. All right. Got him. That's right. I'm using the bow with steel arrows. All right. Got some some boar meat, so that'll sustain us. What is going on? Did he just hit me? Okay. Ah, no, I didn't pick it up. There we go. Now we've got the boar meat. What do you have? So we get this copper wire out of the way, this quest, and then uh, we'll see if we can uh, gather some more quests at that point. Let's see, I think six. Nope. What's my harvest? Oh, nine. Jeez. It's five star apples. Much water. Do I, uh oh, those things. We have a horned chameleon up there, but uh, let me see how much water I have left. Okay, got 46 plus some honey. Does he see me? Oh, yep, now he sees me. Okay. <clears throat> Whoa, what happened there? Okay, there are those horned chameleons. Oh, now we're bleeding. Uh, I'm just gonna. One, two, three, four. We stop bleeding. Alright. Let's take about five hit points, one point each from bleeding when we get stuck by him. I don't know if that's standard for all, if it just kind of stops after a while. But if you're down in hit points, you might need to, that's why I carry bandages with me. Just in case, because that will generally stop the bleeding. Okay, tortoise and a horse are fighting. we got two tortoises here. Ugh. Come on, equines, you can do it. There's a dog. Now the dogs are fighting the horses. What is going on? What do we got? Okay, the tortoise might spot me and no, be still. You go, guys. Jeez. Take care of that light work for me. Heat tortoises. In this game. And we'll get past this map section here and then we'll take a look up at the world map. Alright, almost there. Uh, it's midday. So lots of light. Let me get out. Really? Gotta deal with another chameleon. Okay, flaming hands. Mark the target. Let's mark the target. And no. <clears throat> oh, geez, I wasted that. Okay, we're bleeding again. Oh, there's two salt hoppers. Do they see me? I don't know. They're fighting the uh, equines. Where's the seed spitter? Oh, there's the seed spitter. Okay. Uh, all right. Uh, I'm trying to figure out if I want to bring out my pistols again. And that shot went wild. Yep. Let's go back here for a minute. Anybody follow me? Okay, so we're getting the pistols out. There's quite a few uh, things here I don't want to really deal with with just a bow. Okay, we're gonna remove that. Although I do have a shotgun. Let's try that. And we actually do have some ammo. 
So I'll wait until the critters get close to me. And oh, let me see if I can heal. Yes, okay, good. All right. Hmm. Ugh, what happened there? Did I miss? Oh yeah, I missed with the... Critical hit. Now I missed with my, uh, with my flaming hands. Okay, now I can do it again. Okay. Let's, let's try this again. Okay, now he's on fire. <clears throat> Seed spitter. Everybody? I probably did. Dang it. No more shotguns. Yep. Oh, God. I hit the horse and the dragonfly by accident. Man, these guys are nasty. Hit the yep. Oh, dang it. Oh, I hate this. Okay, we have 32 points. We might have to... Uh, Didn't want to do that. Probably should have thought that through a little bit. And we're going to load these guys. Okay. All right, the Equimax is attacking me now. So we're going to have to do something here. Okay, here we go. What are my choices? <clears throat> Not much to do except try to do as much damage as I can. Oh, we're down to 15. I don't think I'm going to survive this. It might be easier to just load the game up again because, oh man, I shouldn't have pulled that shotgun out. I know better than that. All right, let's catch him on fire and then run. Well, we're down to eight, and now the other horses are attacking me. Yes, they are. How's that happen? Let's go up. <laughs> oh no, I'm getting stuck. Get some snap jaws here. Get out of my way. <laughs> Get out of the way. Okay. All right, somebody just, I think it was a gas grenade. Okay, we're down to, we're up to 19 hit points. Got him. I'm just trying to make my way through here and trying not to garner the attention of those equal maxes. There was two of them that were chasing me. Okay, we're at 23. Two. We'll risk it. Okay. And I see a salt hopper up there. He's going to spot me pretty soon. All right, we're going to get past this and then uh, there he goes. Yep, here he comes. See if we can set him on fire and then we'll shoot him. <laughs> Please don't set me on fire. Okay. Salt hopper ship. Who's shooting at me now? What's going on? I have no idea. Another short bow. <clears throat> no, we'll just take the one. Hello, snap jaw. Okay. Can I heal? Yes, healed. What's our inventory like? One slug, 11 shotgun shells. 
So it's going to be time to put the uh, revolvers away pretty soon and keep the bow out. About character, I still got 115 points to spend on skills. <clears throat> but I do need to, uh, I can buy some skills as soon as I get enough points. I've got uh, that stat up there where it needs to go. All right, let's take a look at the world map real quick. Okay, we're on top of the uh, northern rust well, so it's just going to be a matter of finding an entrance. Oh, jeez. You know something? Uh, yeah. How many? I've got uh, three, four slugs total left. Save those for an emergency. All right, we're gonna put the put the uh, revolvers away and get out the short bow, and then we have to load it. Uh, let's go wooden arrows since we have a lot of those. Why is that like that? Right missile weapon. Okay, never mind. <clears throat> I'm good. Heal. Really have to learn to slow down when I'm walking through some of this stuff, especially at night because I can't see what's going on. And sometimes I'll look over at the right side of the map or the left side or look at my stats and I'm still moving and uh-oh. Didn't want to do that. Okay, where's that coming from? Of range you got on that sucker. Alright, we're sipping on some water here. Oh, look, a horned chameleon right in the middle of everything. Yep, boar meat would taste better salted. I agree. Okay, Flaming Horned Chameleon dies. We're almost leveling, we're almost leveled up. Come on, a salamander? No, I'm bleeding. Oh, now the salamander's hitting me. Jeez. <sighs> what the hell? What did I do to you? I think I may have burned him a little bit. Okay, it did save, so I won't worry about doing that. almost forgot about that. Yeah, I see it. I don't have to kill everything. Oh, look, another salt hopper. So, do that. See if we can do some damage. Come on. Are we hitting? I think we do. Yes, we did. We get level seven. Two hit points, 82 skill points, and one mutation. Yes, okay. We could don't enemies around, so that gives us an opportunity to take a look at our character sheet here. Two mutation points. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna go for another random mutation. What's this one gonna do? Okay, so this level, next level, okay, so it's gonna double the damage. It'll double double the damage for flaming hands. And now we have some skill points we can, we can spend. So what was I, bows and rifles, that's right. Okay, suppressive fire, you fire at a marked target. If your shot penetrates, your target is suppressed and can't move for three to five rounds then your target is unmarked. I like that. 
I am going to take advantage of that. What's wounding fire, though? You fire at a marked target. For each penetration on each shot that hits, your target bleeds one point of damage per round. Sure fire. You fire at a marked target with no accuracy penalty. The accuracy of your weapon still matters. Then your target is unmarked. Okay. Well, not moving. Bleeding damage. Hmm. Let's do suppressive fire. Okay, so that's all right. So we have suppressive fire now. Stay away from those. What are those called? Kudzus. Yeah. If they bleed, I mean, if you get blood on your weapons and equipment, it can. It's not good. Cause them to rust, and then they'll they'll be pretty much worthless. So you want to try to avoid that. And if you do have something that has blood on it in your inventory, you might want to consider dropping it. Okay, come on, rust wells. See some copper wire coming up here pretty soon in our future. Okay, <clears throat> the dogs and the kudzus are at war with each other. And sometimes if you walk, just if you walk by one of these things, it'll get blood on you. It's something. It's mildly annoying. Alright, uh, we're in... I don't know what time of day it is. Hopefully it's going to be light soon. Come on. Oh. Annoying. Whoa, hello. Alright, these chameleons are getting a little easier to fight. I don't really know what to do. I'm sure there's something that we can do with those corpses besides eating them. Maybe take advantage of some of the natural weapons that they have on them, but I have no idea. I'm at a loss. Let's see, let's look up real quick. Okay, now let's hit, let's move south, but we're going to save it. I think it did save, but we're going to save it again. And jump back in. Level 7. And now let's get out. Oh, 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 what's this? <clears throat> I'll take star apples. But what is, okay, what just happened? The novice of the sightless way sunders your mind for five damage. What? What? Hang on. My mind has been sundered. Which one? This guy? <sighs> and what's this? Cannibal. All right. I'll bite. <laughs> Flamed him. And now we're fighting this cannibal. Okay, we got the cannibal. There's another one. <clears throat> Steel kukri. Let's take the kukri. There you are. Steel Vine Reaper. Iron Buckler. Let's auto-equip that Iron Buckler. That was a little unexpected. Maybe. Okay. Yeah, everything's mutated on this world. What are these guys? Goats or... Yep, goat. Never underestimate a goat. And safety tip of the day, never turn your back to a goat. <clears throat> Isakari Banner? All right. <clears throat> Excuse me, let's look at this. Salt Spangled Crimson Banner of the Asakari Nomad people. All right, we'll, we'll get that. And a Steel Warhammer. Don't really need that. Getting encumbered here. 
not quite, but I don't just want to grab everything. Okay, we have uh, skunks, we've got cannibals and goats battling each other. It's mass hysteria. Oh, now they're following me. Get out of here. Okay. Oh, it takes us so long before harvest. It's just a simple matter of walking up and picking something off of a plant. There's got to be some entrance in here somewhere. What? Oh boy, what is that? Chitinous puma. And the irritable tortoise. Novice of the sightless way. Sorry, I'm gonna go back this way. Because there's got, what, what's, what is that? All right, there's got to be, um, I'm gonna go down because Try this. Another skunk. What kind of skunk is that? Honey skunk. Okay, that's just different color. Look at the map. See, yeah, I've got to go down and get past these things here. So, oh, the skunk just let loose. Sorry. Get out of my way. Uh oh, music, the music plays. The goat gains a level. The goat here just gained a level. He's going to town. Come on, goat. I'm rooting for you. Oh, the goat just bit it. Uh, you know what? We're going to go down one more. There's a baboon. Oh, baboons. Great. <laughs> Come on, guys. Okay. They're hitting me. Okay, sorry. We're going to flame a baboon here. Okay, we're down to 35, 32. We're doing some wild melee here. Uh, let's see, 31. Oh, the skunk, no, tell the skunk to leave me alone. I'm just being friendly. Let's go this way. Oh yeah? Come on. Yeah, why didn't I auto get that? Okay. All right, let's investigate this area right here. It's getting dark again? Nope, I don't know. You're gonna have to come around and see me, buddy. There you go. Yeah, I know you're there. Archer's a little tougher. So what do we have here? Another buckler. Iron dagger. Oh, nothing I really want right at the moment. Stop that. Copper wire is what we're looking for. Okay. So it appears to be the snapjaws aren't going to be... We're down to 24. He's pretty tough. Uh, is, uh, what's going on? Oh, there's a guy right there. Okay. All right. So it's healed. Got uh, ambushed by several. Picked up the arrow. Mm. 
Can't believe we haven't found any wire yet. We're right in the kind of right in the middle of the. Uh, uh, we can go over one more to the right, and that'll put us in the middle of everything. I think. Let's head to the edge of the map here. Okay, stop for a moment. Uh, I am going to save it and take a break because uh, time's up. I got to go. And when we come back, huh, I swear we're going to find these rust wells. They're a little harder to find than they usually have been. So we'll get them. We'll get that wire. We'll get it. We'll take it back. All right, guys. Hope you're enjoying the series. Caves of Cud, Gunslinger. Catch you later.